When Thor and Oakenshield is the dad of Freddy from iCarly and the and Lori Grimes in one movie, you're in for an interesting movie. This is the intro, bitch. So just watch my shit. And that's what I'm talking about today, Into the Storm. Now Into the Storm is another found footage movie. Again, I hate Chick Cam, that's all I'm gonna say, I hate Chick Cam. Into the Storm is a found footage movie with found footage, and the basic idea is this big fucking storm is coming and it's gonna kill the town. That's the basic idea. Now, okay, first off, I'm gonna go and explain every single story for you, because there, there are three stories in this movie, but these three or four stories all intertwine. They're happening at the exact same time, okay? First, I'm gonna start off with the one that doesn't matter. The two rednecks! Now, if you guys don't know, despite my Batman shirt, I'm Batman. I am a redneck. I live in a hick town. I don't know, I don't know why I do, but apparently I do, and rednecks are my people. Fuck you! Let's move the fuck on. Now, these two rednecks, they're just those YouTube fuckers that do crazy shit and get put it on YouTube. My people. Now, what happens is they're amateur tornado filmers. They go out into the fucking field for no fucking reason and get their fucking camera and film the fucking tornado. That's what they do. That's their thing and they like it. Even though they're shit face drunk. Now they, they, they come and meet the other people's stories from time to time, but they really don't fucking matter. That's all with that story. Let's move on to another one. Now the one with Freddy from my Carly and Thor and Oak and Shield. Badass. Now Freddy and Thorin, I'm calling Freddy and Thorin because I'm awesome. Fuck you. I'm Batman. Let's move on. Now Freddy and Thorin, they go looking for... Thorne's other son, Freddy's brother, because he got trapped in a building with this chick because he was helping her film some documentary thing about storms. And he really doesn't make out with her, fuck her, or grab her tits or anything in the fucking movie because they're alone. I'd fuck her. <laughs> yeah, so anyway, what the fuck. They get trapped, and Thorin and Freddy go to rescue them. That's their story. Now, Lori Grimes and Replaceable Man 1 and Replaceable Man 2, they are, they are professional tornado chasers. They have this unrealistic truck that plants itself into the fucking ground with these nailed, sharp fucker things. And they go into the center of a fucking tornado, and they stay there, apparently, because you have to have an unreal truck in an unrealistic movie. Who knew? And their story clashes with Thorn and Freddy and other dude, and their story, and Freddy's story clashes with the Storm people, and it's really a good movie. Everyone ends up in this sewer pipe where the storm is coming, and it's windy and shit, and it's shaky cam, and I hate shaky cam! Fuck shaky cam! Fuck it! Now they're in the storm train, and they're sitting there, and they're chilling, and it's all windy and crumbling shit, and... I'm not going to tell you how the movie ends because I'm a professional. I'm giving you a non-spoiler video because I am cool like that. I'm that man. Yeah, so that's basically the movie. And honestly, the movie ends in a stupid way. A.K.A. Rednecks. Fucking Rednecks. What should I talk about next? Game movie show? Let me know in the fucking comments below, you fuckers.